Hi guys, I know my hair's straight. Ew. <laughs> so today I'm gonna teach you how to paint the tie-dye swirl. Look, it's so rainbow and cute. And after I teach you how to paint the little rainbow tie-dye swirl thingy, I let you just add whatever you want and I do some palm trees and it looks like a smile. Look at it. <laughs> so I'm gonna show you all the paint and everything that you need to make it and then we're gonna make it together. Okay, so I got my little canvas and I got the acrylic paint. So Artist Loft is like my favorite brand of acrylic paint and especially um, what we're going to be doing is really good with this brand. Look how pretty! Mm. And also I got this round canvas. These ones are really really good. You can find the different shaped canvases at Hobby Lobby. So first we're going to take our acrylic paint and we're going to put them on a little paint palette. Or if you're broke like me, you can use a paper plate. <laughs> So for the tie-dye swirl, these are some pretty good brushes to use. The ones that are like thin at the top. Alright, so the first thing we're going to do is you're going to take your first color. And we're just going to go like this and swirl. And by the way, you can do whatever kind of color that you want. It doesn't have to be rainbow. It could be pastel colors. It could just be blue and green. I'm just showing you the way. And then you add your own little twist on it if you want. Basically, you're going to want to try to find the center of your canvas which I think is like about right here. And you're just gonna make, try to make like a swirl, but just dot it for right now. Make sure your swirl is like far away instead of like really, really small because you wanna make sure that you could fit the other colors in there, you know? You see, we got like our little outline and then you kinda just stroke this way and you just go outwards with it and you just follow all the little dots that you made like that so now we're gonna move on to the next color and you're gonna get your little paper towel and just wipe your paintbrush so yeah basically once you have this one swirl it's like so easy from there because all you do is just do the same thing but um, you change up the colors, so it's pretty easy from there. So the next one we're gonna do is the orange. Don't worry if your canvas isn't round, it'll still look good. All right, dude, we got our orange down, we got our red down, looking pretty good. So now we're gonna do our yellow. The only thing is, you see how like I have a lot of white space right here? If you're doing this and you only have like two colors left, it's only gonna go out to like about here and then you're gonna have a white space. So just make sure like, like I have one, two, I have three colors left. So I need to make sure that another row of this will fit perfectly right here. But if it doesn't, you can just make your strokes like a little bit longer so it fills in all the white space. I hope I explained that okay, but um, yeah. So now my last color is the pink one, and we're just going to put it on this white part, and then it's going to be done! And this is how you draw a little tie-dye swirl. So, I actually wanted to make this like a real painting. Like right now, it's just like a swirl or something. But I think what I want to try is maybe some like palm trees, like right here. Like I have this vision where like two palm trees right here with a little like, um, uh, what's it called? A little hammock in the middle. I think that'd be really cute. So I think I'm going to try that. If you want to draw on top of this, I recommend um, the Deco Color paint pens. They're just paint pens and they work like super freaking good. And I would use the black paint pen, but I don't have any more. So I'm just going to try to use black acrylic paint. But feel free to do anything that you want on top of this. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Look it, I did it! So I wrote, don't worry, be happy, and then I realized that, I don't know if it's just me, but this looks like a face. Like look, two eyes and a little smiley face. So that was kind of cool.
Thank you so much for watching my video. Be sure to follow my Instagram and my TikTok and everything if you want to see when I'm selling art and um, just little updates on me and my art. I love you all so much. Bye. <laughs>